Hey guys, this is Bharat Watch with Phonorino.com and what we have here today is the Xiaomi E action camera. So you may have known about action cameras already thanks to the popularity of this device, the GoPro. This is the Hero 3 Plus model, there is also the Hero 4 but this form factor that GoPro made popular is largely a byproduct of mobile innovation. So this compact camera is an action camera come uh, adventure camera for many so it started out as that but a lot of people are using it in creative ways for storytelling so that's the GoPro hero and this form factor is really special so Xiaomi has intended to replicate this uh, in a very similar form factor with the Xiaomi e action camera but the difference here is that it's very very cheap as you expected with Xiaomi so the e action camera costs a fraction of the GoPro and provides almost exactly the same features as the GoPro. So how is it like and what are the box contents like since this looks like a big box, what is it all about? Let's find out in the unboxing. So let's go ahead and open the box. I've already torn apart some parts of it so let's quickly go into the box and see what this is all about. So before I open the box, I want to quickly show you another thing. This is also the e-camera. This is the separate model. So you, if you want to get the camera alone, then you go for this. But this is a traveler's edition, which comes with a selfie stick that has a remote shutter. So that's the difference between the normal one and this. And this is the e-camera, of course, looks very, very similar to the GoPro. So let's open this traveler's edition now. And there you go, that's the e-camera's Traveler's Edition box. And of course, it comes with the selfie stick. Selfie stick or a tripod stand or whatever you, whatever you want to call it. So this is the e-action camera again. Looks very, very similar to the GoPro, which I will take here. So yes, this is the GoPro and these two are the e-cameras. Obviously, there is no display for cost cutting, but the controls that it has are almost similar so you can see a very similar power button uh, there are also the twin uh, LEDs on the GoPro which are replicated with the round dial on the e-action camera so there is a multi multicolor notification LED that surrounds the power button so it looks quite good the construction the metals are non-existent obviously because of the price but there is also no metal on the GoPro it's completely made of plastic, very durable plastic, I assume. And uh, you've got the panels for all the openings and slots you need. So this is for the battery and this is for the micro HDMI, the micro USB. Thankfully, it is micro USB unlike the GoPro, which is mini USB. It's been a standard since uh, GoPro launched. Let me try taking this out. There you go. So that's also the micro SD card slot here, which you can use. There is the microphone and there is also shutter button with LED. And there is the tripod mount at the bottom. And there is also another set of holes here, probably for stereo recording in microphone. And over to the right, you have the Wi-Fi button and left you have nothing. And yes, this is also waterproof, just like the GoPro and relies on pretty good camera optics and algorithms for everyday shooting and adventure shooting including the availability of slow-mo so that's the e-action camera basically uh, let's uh, dig into the details in a bit but uh, before that let's uh, check out the existing box accessories which in the traveler edition includes a selfie stick which has been very very popular recently so this is the stick that they give you. You just mount that on here and use it as a selfie stick or anything that you want, just uh, even as a normal stand. So that's uh, mainly the stick here. So you can see that it expands just as you would. So that's the nifty selfie stick that they have given with the uh, e-travelers edition box. The battery that's not yet put inside so that's the small battery which again resembles the gopro battery let's take that out so there you go that's the battery 
of the e action camera everything's in chinese but you can see that it is indeed 1010 mah uh, so should be good enough for probably 20 to 30 minutes of recording on the uh, e action camera and then you also have the micro usb cable for connecting it to the pc and transferring all the images and there is also wi-fi on the camera to help you do that so this is the small micro usb cable and you have a bunch of booklets in chinese for the e action camera probably the information guide so the back pops open just like that and you basically insert the battery like this it also has this very similar gopro like thing uh, which you can use to take the battery out so the battery goes in straight the battery is in and now let's close the other parts as well so just like the gopro this is also powered by a 16 megapixel camera uh, xiaomi tells on its website that it's a sony sensor so it's probably X, uh, xperia sensor that's been already used it should be a cmos sensor with a stacked functionality so that's the e action camera powered on it is now on and not connected to any device right now it can uh, you know give out beeps and <laughs> even the beeps are pretty similar to what the gopro does so yes that's the e camera now powered on and in action uh, it can be connected with a phone with uh, the wi-fi being turned on so the wi-fi direct will connect with the phone and you can configure it to work with the app that will let you record and store videos and transfer photos and all that it has very similar functionalities as the gopro it can record at 1080p 60 fps at the max no 4k here and there is also the mode for 1080p 30 fps and there is 720p 120 fps and 480p 240 fps so you can record some pretty good slow motion footage with this thing and also pretty good full hd video so with construction very similar to the gopro this could also be used in drones like the phantom uh, and also in other scenarios like use the underwater casing of the gopro or something like that this is the underwater casing for the gopro which we assume will fit the e action camera too and not really but uh, you might get accessories for this so that's the unboxing and a first look at the xiaomi e action camera we hope this is released in india soon at a reasonable price the price already looks really tempting for example the gopro costs about 25000 rupees and this costs about 6000 to 7000 rupees realistically so in that sense this is the poor man's gopro and we are looking forward to its debut in india soon so that's about it for the video do hit the like button if you liked it and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already for more videos like these and thanks for watching let us know what you think in the comment section below and also if you have any questions do let us know